Greetings. Welcome to Little Steps. My name is Tim. You may email me at how do I do this at yahoo.com or you can leave a comment on my video. You may also visit my web page at www.howdoidothis.webs.com. If I'm moving too fast, you can pause this video and go back and watch it again if you miss something. I urge you to use WordPad, Notepad, or some other means to take and keep your notes so you can get back to this video or you can create steps in your own words for later references. Please use my YouTube channel and my webpage. They're both free. If you could pass on the word, um, you can link to my webpage, uh, leave a comment on YouTube channel, or you can email and order copy of the videos for your friends or family. Now on with the video. Um, you're trying to get your card to computer transfer of your pictures. Cards come in different shapes, different sizes. Okay, be aware of that first. They are specific to your camera. And you will need to utilize either the card in your computer, which may have a built-in, or as you notice there, a Wi-Fi option now for the, for the memory cards, but I'm not going to get into that. But some computers do have the memory cards slots built into them. You some have a dedicated USB cord for your camera. Please be aware of that. If your card, if your camera does not come with the cord, you have other options. You can use the memory stick or card directly in the computer, the dedicated uh, camera, or you can use a multiple card reader that you can buy um, very cheap, about ten dollars, um, either online or in your retail stores. These come in many shapes. They offer many options. You can obviously read more than one memory card from what you can see here in the video. Um, you also can get a direct USB adapter for your memory cards. Or again, going back to the different options for your USB memory card adapters. Please be aware you can also use a universal adapter kit on a USB. Now this is a good item to get because you can also use this on other things such as Ethernet cords, modem cords, um, USB to USB adapters between computers, um, or an extension cord, or Ethernet, and cameras, and printer cords. Now this USB cord is universal. Um, it retails again for about $15. Um, well worth it. You can get them in different lengths. Um, this is more of a last option or to give you more functionality from your USB adapters or cameras. Um, you do have many options, so please be aware of this. Um, you can use this universal adapter cord, memory card, uh, memory card to USB, or a universal USB cord. Okay, we'll try and make this as quick and simple as you can. I'm assuming that you have one of the adapters, you've got your card reader, you've got your camera to computer USB card, or you've got a card reader built into the computer, or an external card uh, reader that's uh, available commercially, um, or you have a universal USB cord that you can adapt up to your camera or to a card reader. Um, you have many options for that. Anyway, let's get on with this. What you want to do is you want to open up Windows Explorer. You want to insert the card. Now remember, you either plug it in with the USB cord, plug it in directly to your computer if you have the memory card reader, or you can plug the camera into the computer with a USB cord with the dedicated USB to camera cord that you can get either with the camera or it's already supplied. Any way you do it, you plug the, you plug the camera or the memory card into the computer by, via whatever means you have available. Uh, already been discussed in this uh, video. Now, let me plug in mine into my computer here. Now you'll notice on the left side of my screen I have my computer in the window. That's internet, or excuse me, 
Windows Explorer. I have the folders view open and I'm going to insert the video card now. You'll notice underneath my computer in the left window pane, you'll see under removable disk the letter H. They're sequential. They're CDEFGH. Now when I click on the memory card and slide it in, you'll notice a dialog box pox pops up here. In the process of this dialog box popping up, you can use wireless. You can copy the pictures to a folder on my computer using Camera Wizard. You can use the software provided with the camera, or you can just use Windows Explorer. Now going back over here to the left side, you'll notice removable disk H now has a little icon here showing you that it's active and that the memory card has been inserted. From there, you can click the plus sign and you'll want to go down and you will want to look in these folders to find your actual pictures. Do not delete these folders. Um, you can delete the pictures that are inside of the memory card. You can select all um, by left clicking on this, hitting your control A, that'll select all the folders. From there you can delete them, but also you can just drag them from this point over to somewhere else in your computer by clicking on uh, my documents, my pictures, and from here you can create a file folder and we can put camera photos. Camera photos. Now from there You've got the camera photos listed right here. There's nothing in that particular file folder. Now if you go back down here and you click on this, once again, left click in the window pane on the right, hit Control A, and then you simply left click and hold your mouse button, drag it over here to camera photos, and it will start copying the camera photos onto your computer. Now you can put these anywhere on your computer you like. I keep these generally on my backup hard drive and I also try to burn copies on CD. Um, anyway, you can, you can use this method for the removable disk option, which will take you through a wizard. I'm not going to demonstrate that because that takes too long and it's too difficult. It's easier just to create the file folder here in my pictures and then drag them down here from your your memory card or your camera, which would show up similar to this, and uh, drag it up to your folder that you've created in Windows Explorer. Um, anyway, you want to do this the quickest and easiest way, and this is the easiest, quickest way to, way to do it.